Hello everyone and welcome to Yugi Mains. We have a special Halloween pack opening for you all. It will be Pokemon from X and Y series the right up to Sword and Shield Darkness of Blaze. We'll also be opening Champion's Path but we'll leave it right till the end. We've also got a giveaway on the go. So we'll be giving away one Sword and Shield Darkness of Blaze and Rebel Clash double blister. So just comment below for a chance to win that. So, as you can see from the cards here, we've got Sword and Shield, or we've got the Sword and Shield series here. We've moved on to Lost Thunder, all the way down to Primal Clash. So let's get into it. Starting off with Sword and Shield, Darkness of Blaze. Hope everyone's having a fantastic Halloween, and I hope you enjoy our pack opening. Four, so what's the energy? What's the energy everyone? Grass. It is grass. Well done. We have a Soul Rock, Kaboo, Summer Siege, Grimer, Clink, Ducklet, Mari, Paris, uh, Gaffatella, Refoil, and a Dracovish Hollow. I haven't pulled this one yet, that's pretty nice. Hollow is quite nice on that. No idea where I'm going to set the cards because we've got so much pack. So, we're going on the second pack of Darkness of Blaze. Code card. Two, three, four. And I'm going to guess far for this one. Leaf again. Whoa. So, we've got Sim Sage, Vanillish, Clang, Fletchling, Wingpod, Grammar, Clink. Ducklet and a hollow Lugia. I wish this had got a hollow, an actual proper hollow printing. It looks so nice, but for some reason it does not. Although I think it's in the vivid voltage as a hollow. So, code card for everyone. And of course, if you can't tell, I am a skeleton. Well, some sort of skeleton, I don't know. I'm going to guess water for the energy, and I guess correctly. Well done. We've got Vanilla Ash, we've got Clang, we've got Goffrey, Goffertail, Goffertail, Skarmory, Jimiko, Wimpod, then will be a Redfall Tauros, and our is a Scizor VMAX. Pretty nice. First VMAX down. Now we're on to Rebels Clash. So. Code card. I suppose boss's orders would be a nice card to put in this set. We've got Fire, Pine Scarf, Smina, Luxio, Pidove, Heptotile, Voltorb, Sandy Gas, Vulpix, Barnacle, and a Infezant Common, a rare. Second pack of Rebels Clash. Let's see if we can pull something nice. Whoa! This pack's a wee bit bent. There's the code. Hope the, the rest of the cards are fine in this pack. So I'm going to guess Steel Energy, Psychic, Vicious Bucket, Horror Energy, Puppetood. Oh, Farfetch. D. I think I'm looking quite angry. Oof. Scooby, Mr. Mime, Caterpie, Barbroach, Menopod, and a... Oh, Flapple. That's pretty nice. Nice pool. Moving on to Rebels. The last pack of Rebels Clash. Code cool card. I'm going to guess far. Steel. Funny that was the last pack. Indeedy, Charterbug, Metapod. Electabuzz, Scorvet, Snover. It's one of my favourite Pokemon. I love its cry in Sword and Shield. Not too Trubbish, Magmar, and an Alcremy. Rare. Now we're moving on to Cosmic Eclipse. I'm going to try and race through this. Try and not make it as long as it might be. Code card. And it's. No. It's still four because it's sun and moon. Energy. 
energy. So what, how many did I do there? We'll find out next pack. So there's electric energy, unidentified fossil, hammer, herder, palpitoad, jackamo, deerling, colette. Oh, that's nice, that artwork. Nice. Jupiter. Jupiter? A by sharp rev foil and our rare is a gilly. Second pack of Cosmic Eclipse. I think there's a good, there's a, a good card in this. I think it's Jirachi. I think it was quite competitive for a while. I think it's been rotated out now though. So there is our code card for everyone at home. Energy. Energy. I'm going to guess Lightning. Fairy. Oh, nice. Fairy energy. A gold duck. Will, Mimikyu, Phantom, Magnemite, Pup, Trap Hinch, Sneasel, Symphia and Catelyn, and we have a Blastoise and Piplop. That's pretty nice. GX Tag Team. That is very nice indeed. Last pack of Cosmic Eclipse. There is the code card for everyone. I'm gonna pick fire. Oh, it's fire. What a, what a, what a surprise there. Gold duck. Pang oh, flip out works pretty nice. Pangor. Her cross. I have no idea what the how to pronounce that. Trap pinch. Labby. A tangler. Dust skull. Oh, look at that artwork. Pretty cool. That would be a nice red foil, that one, or hollow. A Tsumiku and a. Oh, a Secret Rare Martial Art Dojo. That's pretty nice. It's a nice card. Ooh, see gold. Puts haven't been too bad so far. Now it's time to move on to Lost Thunder. Look at that beautiful Lugia on the pack art. Code card. I'm going to guess darkness. We have electric. We have a spell tag. Memory energy. Fespa Queen. Combi. Marine. Lavatar. Oh, that's a nice artwork for Lavatar. Sort of like. I actually fought with this thing. That was that was an actual bomb. <laughs> Looks like a, a bomb in the camera. Like it was flaunting its. Backside, Chubaco, Snubble, Rev Foil, and our Hollow, is, or, or just a Rare, is Hound Doom. It's pretty nice. That would be a nice Hollow. At the end, I'll show off all the Hollow and Rev Foil cards. Not too fussed about the Ordinary Rare. We're on to our last pack of Lost Thunder. Here we go. Three, four. I am going to guess Fairy. And there we go. That's a nice artwork for that. We've got Sableye. We've got Brony. Oh, that's one of the extra part worm pulls. Hoppy Loop. Skiddo. Oh, nice. Like that art looks pretty nice. It sort of looks like it's going through space, but it's, it's not. It's the ground. Ralts. Oh, clay animation. I love them. Oh, I love the Ralts. Skip Bloom and a Steelix. Whoa, that's pretty nice. Pretty cool looking. So we'll put this to Red Foil. So now we're on to Burning Shadows. Very Halloween oriented. It'll be full of ghost Pokemon. So let us know in the comments what your favourite ghost Pokemon is for a chance to win this double pack of Darkness of Blaze and Rebel Clash. And 
Here we go. Hoping to pull some really, really scary ghost Pokemon here. I'm gonna pick Psychic. There we go. Weakness Policy. Heat more. Curlia. Horsey. Venipede. Sneasel. Crab Brawler with his boxing gloves on. And his Fleck, we have Ralts. Course Fairy type Pokemon was removed from Sword and Shield series for some reason. I love to put the, like, the Fairy energy in the Champion's Path. We've got a Curlia, it's a beautiful art, and a Zumo. Put that with the Red Foil pack. We have a total of five Sun and Moon Darkness of Blaze. So we're hoping we can put something nice. Maybe a, a Charizard, that would be a nice pull, but just have to keep hoping. There we go. Code. I'm gonna pick fire energy for this one. It's fighting. Whoops. Charmeleon. It's a pretty nice artwork for that. We've got Formatic Spray, we've got Dust Claps. Here comes the Ghost Pokemon. Crab Roller. Stuffle. Inklay. Dust Skull. That's a nice artwork. Oh, that's nice. We've got a Ray Emperor as our Rare foil rare. It's pretty nice. And our only rare is Shinotic. Nice. There we go, there's a cool card for everyone. Two, three, four. And we got Steel Energy. I'd like to thank everyone who came along to watch as well, because it's it's quite a lot of packs we have to open, so it's always nice and hopefully it brings someone some entertainment anyway at home. The cards are sort of starting to take over now. We've got Caterpie, Marl, that's nice. Rhyhorn, Sandy Gas, oh, Charmander, Red Foil, that is beautiful. It's a beautiful card, and we have Simeon as our rare. No good hollow yet from Burning Shadows, which is quite sad. Quite sad indeed. There's our code card. Two, three, four. I'm going to pick Fire this time. We've got Fairy again. We have a nice, cool looking Dusclops. Simiseer. Mountain Caterpie. Sandy Gas. Venipede. Got Sneasel. We've got Alolan Vulpix. We've got Pampor. And I see a bit of Shiny. Let's see what we pull. Oh, a, a Cold Rare Escape Rope. It's pretty nice. Two secret rare cards so far. This pack one's been pretty good. Got that. So now we're on to our last packet of Burning Shadows. Code card. We have Fighting Energy. Menopod. Bodybuilding Dumbbells. Right on. That's a nice artwork. Right on was the first Pokemon designed as well, for those that don't. No, it was the creator's favourite and first Pokemon. Pompur, Alolan Radata, nice. Mudbray, Electric, and there's a bit of all form of that, so there we go. Moving on to Guardian Rising, and then we're on to our last sort of packs here. So I remember this was one of the first sets I sort of bought when I sort of first got into Pokemon. Tapu Lele was always a nice pull, so I'm hoping to maybe pull Tapu Lele here. There's a code card. I'm going to guess water for this one. It's darkness. We've got Sudowoodoo, Alone Grobbler, Max Potion, Mud Bray, Alone Sandshrew, Cottony, Belt Sprout, Glagar, a Altar of the Moon, and a Swallow Rare. Last packet of Guardian Rising. Of course, I'll put in the comments, I'm gonna put down in set order so that you can skip through to see. There we go, there's the code card. So you can see what, you can pick your opening if you want. If you wanna watch them all, happy days. But if you wanna watch a certain set, you can go into the comments and you'll be able to see it. We've got Psychic Energy. We've got Brickle Hill. We've got Beware, the match are. Beware sign behind, see that? Lumpin, Cast Form, Phantom, Tilo. Oh, this looks like it's gonna be another good hit. Oh, we've got the foil. 
Walmer, Trubbish, Pangro, what could this be? What could it be? Oh, maybe maybe if it could be anything, it could be anything. Tapu Lele? Yeah. Oh, I wish it was Tapu. Let's go! Oh, I wish he was it. Oh, well. <laughs> Still something. So now we're on to our base set, Sun and Moon, and then the next opening after that will be Evolutions. Hopefully pull a Charizard. That Charizard has went and skyrocketed recently. So here we go. There's our code card. One, two, three, four. I think this is four cards. I'm going to check. I'm going to pick water. Ah, there we go. Uh, Poliwhirl, Steeny, Co Paris, Poliwag. Oh, I like that Poliwag. It's a nice Poliwag. Trooper, Eevee, Simeon, and a Stutland. Last packet of Sun and Moon base set. Last pack magic on this one. There we go, there's the code card. Two, three, four. And I'm gonna pick fire for this one. We got fighting. We've got Rotom Dax, Simeon, Halu, Sandy Gas, Dratini, Dragon. They also removed Dragon from any packs in Sword and Shield for some reason. I thought dragons are quite quite cool with the, the yellowy colour, but now they've just got it down to Bon Sweet, Skarmori. I've never actually seen this Pokemon before. Pomadas. Pomadas. Pretty cool looking actually. I've, I've never actually seen this one before. And our rare is uh, Sword and Shade. Or someone really let us down here. But now we're on to evolutions. Hopefully we can pull a nice charge out or something nice. Hopefully Champions Path will can pull a shiny one. So we're on to our evolution pack. This set has been crazy hyped at the minute. Don't understand why. There's a charge art in the set, so that might be why. But this pack I just opened like a dream. So here we go. We're looking at the old school codes now. I don't think it really matters what color it is in these packs. No idea about this set. So one, two, three, four. It's a three deep. So let's sit here. Right, so with the help of Lando. Oh, it's got to whiff that Pokemon magic. There's no energy in it. I think that's just a special. I don't think there's an energy in this one, but I think this pack's just, it's going to be messed up. So I'm just going to open them as is. So we've got double colorless energy, which is always nice. We've got a Nidorino. This is a reset of, a reprint of base set one and base set two. So you'll see the classical artworks, which is always nice. We've got Charge Art Spirit Link. Of course, one of the, oh, there we go. Mega Venusauri Axe. That's pretty nice. It's the number, the first card in it, isn't it? Oh, no, it's number two. So it must be Ordinary Venusaur. So that is a nice pull from this pack. We've got Rodata, we've got Caterpie, we've got Magnemite. Of course one of these packs by themselves goes for about 10 pounds now, which is crazy. And we've got a red foil Kakuna. So on to the second pack of our X and Y evolutions. There we go, there's the card. And Lundy's telling me it's three cards, but we'll see. Is it three? Is that an energy? Right, so you can't do the energy trick with this set. Nice, so I'm... Oh, it's not an energy? Does it, it put the rare, the rare card at the back? I think so. Right, so here we go. We'll just open as is. We've got Coughing. We've got a Revive. We've got a Ghastly. It's pretty nice. Looks like a, a job done on paint. We've got Caterpie. Drizzy. Muddy Carp, Carp, Carp. Oh, well, there's no Gyarados in this set. It'd be nice to have a, the reprint of Gyarados in it. We've got Electabuzz. We've got a... Refoil Pokédex, and we have a, oh there we go, a, me a Mega Pidgeot EX. Pretty good hits from Evolutions, so far. Evolutions was pretty good. <coughs> there we go, code card. And it's three. Let's see if we can pull the charge out, is there a charge out in here? Oh, this just so happened to be an energy. Double colourless. Yeah, just uncommon. Super rare, Charmeleon. Oh, is this a sign? Are we going to see Charizard here? I'd love to put one of them. I have the Evolutions Charizard, but it's a bit worn at the top corner, so replacing it would be quite nice. Oh, this does have an energy on it. Oh, yeah. 
Rod attack. Energies must just be you can get one, you might get one. Fulpix. Electabuzz. It's quite basic artwork, but it's, it's very nice. Our rare foil is Kakuna again and. Is it shiny? Is it shiny? Oh! Oh, there we go. A Slowbro EX. That was three good hits from them packets. They were quite good. So now we're on to Steam Siege. I don't think there's anything overly good in Steam Siege. I think there's some good cards. So there we go. There's the Steam Siege code. So it's three. One, two, three. And. Oh, no. It's not. Maybe this doesn't have an energy in it. I'm not too sure. Oh, the artwork in this is pretty nice. We've got an armored fossil shield on. We've got a mountain. We've got a clink. Oh, look at that. One of my favorite YouTubers has a clink as one of it. Is his intro, which is pretty nice. Oh, what? We've got a steel spirit link and a Cla clink clang. There we go. That's always nice to add. And a red foil spirit link. So. Last pack of Steam Siege, and then we've got a couple more sets to open, and then we're going to move on to Champions Pass, so make sure you stick around for that. There we go. And of course, if you like our content and want to see more of it, like and subscribe. So here we go. Got Sheldon. Oh, we can, we can evolve that with a Fossil now. We've got Persian. We've got a Rapidy Rapidash. Clonsher. Shelios. Both regions, the west and the east, isn't it? The east one's pink and the west is blue. Right. Something like some of that effect anyway. A rufflet. A chimchar. It's nice artwork. A Dino, which is dragon. A Gardevoir Spirit Link and a Hydreigon. Hollow. It's pretty nice. We're gonna get one packet of breakpoint, but let's see if we can get something nice in this wee bad boy here. I have no idea what's good in this set. I dropped the cool card. You're not getting the cool card for that, it seems. Maybe show it at the end. So here we go. We've got Heatmore. Sudowoodoo. A Pochon. A Chikorita. Temple. A Spritzy. I remember opening this set. I, I did buy actually quite a lot of this set, so the artworks do look quite... quite... similar, anyway. So now we've got two packs of Ancient Origin and two packets of Primal Clash left to open before we move on to Champion's Path here. Here we go. I think the Rayquaza in this set would be a nice pull. So there's our code. Energy? Oh, maybe there's no energies from... So... Bl Blossom. It's a nice artwork, actually. That would be a lovely hollow. Ace Trainer. Hey, Special Energy. A Malamar. Baltoy. Oh, look at that Beldum. He's just floating there, it's clay. Sexy. Yo, go look. Hey, Relicanth. Hey, Refoil Persian. That's actually nice artwork. And we have a Reggie Ice. Ordinary rare. He's pretty cool. Last pack of prime or last pack of ancient origins before we move on to primal clash. There we go, there's a code card. Two, three. Here we go, we'll start off with, with starting off with a gloom. A Vaporeon. Lysander. Card was monster, I think it got banned, didn't it? Lysander did get banned in the TCG? The Pokemon TCG? Of course it's been rotated out now, I like, but it's such a good card. Veralts. Persian again. Unknown? Oh no, Nernus. What is that? A-N-D-A question mark. Panda? Oh, there's another one there. Ah, oh, they're just random. Combe, thought I was trying to spell something. And a Ordinary Rare Metagross. It's pretty nice, that one. Now on the Primal Clash. And then we'll move on to Champion's Path. Of course, the codes, I think back further this back, yeah, the codes were always just white, so there was no really w real way to tell them apart. 
So one, two, three. We have a escape rope, a cilio, arty ace in the hole, horsey, that's a lovely artwork, skitty, tangler, trico, honage, Adi slash, and a, oh nice, a mega agroni axe, it's pretty nice now, we've got so many good hits from this opening, so many excellent opens. Also, the packs are opening like a treat. They're just completely ripping off. So there is our code card. One, two, three. We've got a the noon, a Kyogre Spirit Link, a Kakuna, a Kabuda, Kakun. Yeah, I got it right the first time. Kakuna, Soul Rock, Mudkip, Trap Hinch, standing up on its legs, its hind legs. Nose pass, Spinda, a Agron Spirit Link, and a Ordinary Rare Starmie. So that is all the cards. The loose boosters so far. I'll show off what we've opened. So here is all the Rev Foils. Combi Persian. I really like the uh, Evolutions Foils. So this is just like rewinding the video. You can see all the hollows. How do you get in there? Oh, here's a foil. I didn't even notice that. And of course, here's all the hits from the pack so far. Quite a good, uh, two secrets and quite a lot of full art cards. Oh, there we go. Now it's time for the main event. We're going to move on to the Champions Path pin collection, and it, this is definitely the it definitely has my two favorite promos in it because you've got Gengar and Machamp, two of my favorite Pokemon, and of course you get the two the pins that are pretty nice. So there we go. Here's the back of it. Full product view of that. I'm really excited about this. Champion's Path is really, really good at the moment. So here's the contents close up. Got the thing, pins and the promos. I'm sort of hoping that the promo cards are in good condition because we'll probably send them off to PSA. Whoops. And the promo cards. I'm gonna insert in the back. So you just take them like this. And then, bang! There we go. Well, look at the promo cards. Look yeah, the gang cards. Oh, it might be a wee bit off center. A wee bit off center. No, that looks pretty good. I probably will submit it because Gengar is one of my favorite Pokemon cards. And the match on is, uh, it looks a little bit off center. Good bit, but usually with promos, they usually end up damaged anyway, so it's quite hard to get promos in good condition. And of course, we have the pins, we have the fighting one, and of course, the ghost one. So we've got five packets of. Champions path to open. Hoping to get a couple of good hits from this. There's been a lot of people just buying up Champions Path, so it doesn't really give people a chance to really buy and open and enjoy. So hope you can enjoy the the opening of this. We're not them crazy people that are out there buying loads. So here we go. Here is the code card. One, two, three, four. And we're really hoping for a Charizard. Well, I suppose all the cards are good. It's, it's good that you get a hollow in every pack. We've got Turfled Stadium, we've got Carvana, we have Potion, Rock Rough. The artwork's phenomenal in all the cards as well. We have a Swab Blue, we have oh, a Water Hollow Energy, and our a Gravel Plot V. 
I don't know if I pronounced that right, but it is a nice, nice full art. I'll set the rev energy here, it's pretty nice. So we'll go on to our second pack. Code card for everyone. I'm gonna guess fighting this time. We've got steel. We've got a hop. B drill. Hatrim. A Weedle. Kuna. Carvana. Potion. A Vault Bix. A Red Foil Tuffle Stadium. And a Professor's Research. Nice. Three packs left. Code card. I'm gonna guess fighting for this. We have fire. Could this be a sign for a Charizard? Sini Arbok. Rotan Bike. Ekans. Oh, the artwork is so good in all this. It's, it's just opening the packs. It's really, it's beautiful. Scraggy. A really cool. A hop. And a, another professor's research. You hate whenever you get doubles of hollows, but in such a small set, you're always going to run into them at least. Oh, Pokemon goodness there. There we go. Code. I'm going to pick water this time. Fire again. We have an Arbok. Hop. A Rotan Foam. A Sizzlypede. A Hatrina. Nicket, Inkle, Really Cooly, uh, Refoil, Zygarde, and a Lucario V. The artwork is really nice on that. Two Vs in one pack, that's pretty good for a. At least the Gengar didn't, didn't let us down here. Quite a lot of nice pulls from this. So there's the code card for everyone. Two, three, four. Although I'm noticing that the packs are a bit. Look at the edge, we're on the east spot, boys. Oh. Every single card scuffed, but... I'm gonna pick Grass Energy. We have Psychic. Turfield Stadium. Bide. Kaboo. Weedle. Kakuna. Kravana. Potion. A Vulpix. Pokemon Center Lady and a Santa Scorch Hollow. Had to be Santa Scorch Hollow. They put that in every single set for some reason, and it's it's not even that good, so. It's just a big Santa Pete, like. So here's what we've got from Champions Pa. I hope you've enjoyed our our big pack opening because it, it has it has took us a lot of effort to get them all gathered up for everyone. And I hope everyone's having a good Halloween. And remember to comment down below to enter into our Darkness of Blaze double pack. Just comment your favourite ghost Pokemon and you will be entered into our giveaway. And of course, thank you for watching everyone.